Welcome to Red 35 and today we are in Holland Park. When I say the word England, what comes through your mind? You could say quite a few things. You could say like uh, Red Buses, uh, Big Ben, uh, Fish and Chips, The Queen, Tea and Crumpets, James Bond. Matt um, Carmen. Matt Carmen, I'm English. <laughs> English, handsome, international model. But I found something prettier. Okay. Yeah, there you go. The brand new Billingham Hatley One camera bag. Are oh, we going to look at this today? So Jimmy, I hear you've got a gift for me. Yes, man. Check this out. Very nice. Very nice. It's one from your collection. Uh, yeah, well, yes and no. It, it, I know I have a lot of Hetleys around. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, uh, but this is, no, this is actually a brand spanking new model from Billingham. Only launched in 2017, this year. Okay. Uh, it may look very similar to all the other Hetleys, but it's totally different in many, many ways. Um, but yes, it's, it's a great bag. I think it suits you. Amazing, yeah, thanks. Uh, what makes you choose Billingham? Um, well, it's um, many reasons because First, it looks good. It's very classy and it's very durable because many uh, past master photographers has used Billingham bags for decades, and, and so I know it's durable, which is very good for me, you know, as a professional. And also, it's very functional. Uh, it's weatherproof, you know, so I can carry it in rain. I can, you know, do sorts of all sorts of stuff to it, and I know it will still survive. And it protects my gear as well. So Jimmy, I appreciate it, but why did you get me a camera bag? I'm not, I'm not a photographer. <laughs> well, you know, um, uh, one of the main thing about this new Billingham Hatley one is how versatile this is. Mm -hmm. You know, you can actually take all the insert out, it becomes a briefcase. Nice. And it actually comes with half insert, so which means that you can actually use it as a half camera bag and half normal bag, so you can have half of the size for whatever you want, you know, your maybe cardigans, you know, your water bottles or some personal belongings. And it has a, like a dedicated compartment which you can for your iPad or, or laptops. So I think it, it kind of suits you, you know, you can actually take all, everything out, just become a normal bag. Yeah, very versatile. Yeah. One thing you may not know is that Billingham used to make fishermen's bag and many photographers started using it because it has the same similar kind of um, uh, features like basically compartments and sections so you can put different accessories uh, similar like you put lenses in so like you know uh, uh, they found a similarity in it and at the time you know like uh, there aren't many kind of well protected camera bags around you know uh, back in the old days and uh, they were quite good for that you know it's padded inside and uh, so you can keep your gear safe and dry and you know and you can do it in style Jimmy, talk to me about the different features this uh, has as opposed to your other bags. Well, you know, like, um, first of all, the main difference is it has a different strap because now you can actually take it off. Okay. Yeah, because all the other older, uh, actually, in fact, most of the uh, Billingham bags, the, uh, the strap actually attached to the bag, right. actually stitched in completely. So it's fixed, you cannot remove it. But this one, you can actually just basically remove the stud there. So you can uh, basically turn this shoulder back into a complete briefcase, okay. you know, just a hand holder. Yeah, so you see, it's quite simple and just uh, unbuckle a couple of sides. Yeah, cool. Nice. So you can take that off and then, uh, and by doing so, because now they realize that you're going, you may be carrying some heavy folders and things like that, or maybe even camera equipment. So what happened is they actually putting a, a padded leather bits here. Nice. So, uh, so it's basically, it feels better when you hold it back. Yeah. And, and the, all the other headleys before where they have handles, they're all basically just using these materials. Okay. So it may take into your fingers a little bit more if you hold it for a bit longer. So they're trying to make it a little bit more comfortable. And then other features, if you turn the, turn the back around, so you see this bit, you know, like when you're traveling, going traveling, you have a trolley. This one can slip straight into Absolutely, it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, basically, this will sit on your uh, on top of your trolley. Nice. So uh, it basically frees your, frees your shoulder a little bit, so it makes it a little bit more comfortable. And uh, just a one traveling feature that this has. And then also this, this is a brand new feature here. Um, it's very similar to one of the older Hatley, but now it's made of leather. 
thicker leather and it's uh, and also if you lift it up completely you can see the uh, the storm proof uh, uh, zip so now it's completely waterproof now and it opens full width all the way to the end and uh, the previous Hetley um, uh, Pro the uh, zip doesn't go all the way so uh, okay. so it's, it's harder to put folders in or papers in in full size yeah. now pull this around let's open the back up so I can show you more stuff so let's open it okay so now you see the inside of it sure okay right I put in two sections here at the moment but it the, when, when you get the back new it only comes half of it okay so this is basically what it comes with only half size so this size where you can actually put personal belongings anything you want and this side is for camera but again you don't need to put a camera in you can actually put something else or I just un basically unbutton it and even take this bit out nice. so now you have a full size bag plenty of space plenty of space good for leaves yeah, <laughs> and yes, this is the bit. Yeah, you know, like where it uh, now has a dedicated uh, laptop or uh, a tablet compartment, so you can put electronic devices in it, nice. and it's also protected because of the padded material. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, it's it's a very well featured bag, and also um, the front is very traditional Hatley. All Hatleys has a two front pockets, okay. so this is no exception. It's very similar. It has uh, two kind of pen holder on either side. Um, yeah, it, it's it's just a generally. A very Hatley Hatley bag, mm. but with kind of modernized feature where now you can put laptops and electronic devices in, and also very customized uh, uh, layout you can actually do within the bag. So you can uh, put one of these, two of these, or one big actual um, uh, full size um, uh, compartment inside. So yeah. you can actually put bigger cameras and things like that in there as well. It's amazing the amount of space you get. It, it, it is. I mean, it, it does actually look bigger than it is. Yeah. And uh, it's the well, according to Billingham, you can actually put an A4 size folder in it. So like a big one of those big ring bind folder. Yeah. So uh, um, so this is actually quite a good size. First, I start with the front pocket. There we go. I usually carry my filters, my lens pen on the side here, uh, lens cloth mic for flogging, batteries, wallet, close this bit now, and now this side, power bank, and memory cards, now close that bit now, and big iPad at the back, Oh, I didn't empty it. Lens. <laughs> One extra lens. Camera with a lens. A flocking camera. Flocking tripod. Hand cream. And then close it. Right, Matt, I gave you this bag because, you know, it looks good like you. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. And it has quality like you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> if you think so. <laughs> of course, of course, yes. Uh, so, as far as the, the, the materials like this, is this canvas or...? Uh, well, good question because um, all the Bingland bags, mm -hmm. they used to make from uh, uh, basically cotton-based canvas. Right. Um, but as, you know, like, uh, technology improves, and Billing has introduced this, which is called the fiber night material. Oh, so, it's, so it's actually a man-made material that makes it look like canvas or like normal cotton canvas, mm -hmm. but it's actually lighter than canvas right. and also thinner, more durable, but has the same kind of waterproofness right. as the treated canvas because uh, Billing has a very special kind of coating underneath, so it makes it completely waterproof. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. And what, what about the leather? Does that differ from other bags or? Uh, no, apart from thicker. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, it, it's thicker, I think, because they want to improve the durability of the bag. So uh, they make it thicker in, in certain parts of it and then to make sure that, you know, uh, the use of the most worn area are protected more. Mm. So they, they want 
the, I think users to use it a bit longer period. Uh, although actually having said that, you know, Billingham actually does offer repair services. So I have to mention that. So, you know, if certain parts of it does become worn out, have a hole somewhere if you want to repair it, but actually some people like a bit more worn look in a way. Enough, but yeah. if people like a pristine condition thing, if something worn off, torn off, breaks, you know, you can actually send it back to Billingham. They can replace and repair for you. Like right. certain panels even. For free, yeah? No. <laughs> <laughs> the Hatley one does come with black. Right. This uh, this what they call the sage color with chocolate brown leather. Okay. Uh, the black with black leather. And I think it has one with uh, kind of like a more traditional khaki color as well. Okay. Um, so it's got three colors at the moment, so you never know. Billing always like to introduce new colors, so they might have some newer fashionable colors in the future. But always like classic look, which is, you know, like, this is a very classy bag. So I think you should actually have a classy, you know, colors, combinations of, you know, suit the outlook of it. Nice. Quality, gentlemanly style. I like it. So Matt, what do you think of the bag that I just give you? It's, it's a great bag. Uh, I think it's uh, well built, it's robust, it's got a lot of style and I'll, I'll be using it a lot. Great stuff to hear. Well, if you want to see more of um, camera bag reviews or actually any reviews or even more interesting just looking at us in the videos, uh, please do subscribe to our channel. And you can also follow us, like and comment on our Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and we're going to put the link down below. You can check out Matt's portfolio and his great looks. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, mate. Yeah, and also, you know, like, please leave a comment down below and tell us what's your favorite Billingham bags. Okay, so uh, that's it, yeah, I'm off. Uh, okay. Oi, 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 my camera's in there, wait.